<laughs> What's so funny, Thea? You giving away free food? No, but I've been here since six this morning. I got plenty of free attitude. You want some? <laughs> Carry on. Huh, I didn't think so. Happy Thanksgiving. <laughs> Oh, there's my baby. Did you get everything on list? Yeah, Mama, but you know, it's really crazy back there. You're running low on a lot of stuff. I mean, a fight almost broke out. Hey, that nutmeg was mine. She knew not to go there. <laughs> all right, you're all set, ma'am. You have a good turkey day. Gobble, gobble. <laughs> hey, how y'all doing? Jamester, the gangster, Jerome, my homie, Denisha. Denisha. <laughs> What's wrong with him? Oh, he gets excited when we get busy like this. He loves it, because he just keeps going and going and going. He's my little energizer bunny. And look how fast his hands move. <laughs> They're little two brown blurs. Thea, don't forget, we're opening at 7 tomorrow. 7. OK. Wait a minute, you work at Thanksgiving? Yeah, the schedule finally caught up with me. <laughs> Who's going to feed me? <laughs> I'm cooking Thanksgiving dinner this year. No, seriously, Mama, what are we going to do? <laughs> You heard her. Now, she's helped me every year in the kitchen. And it's time to pass my turkey baser on to my only girl. Yes. I'll be right back. I'm going to get some backup turkey pie pie. <laughs> Just playing, girl. Uh, here you go. All right, man. All right. Bye, Mom. Bye, babies. See y'all. Baby, do you want to get those items and put them back on the shelf? Oh, no problem. Fine, Connie. Fine, thanks. Guess what I need? Connie can't work tomorrow because her grandmother died. Again? <laughs> Come holidays, that woman's grandmother start dropping like fly. <laughs> well, if she loses one on Christmas, she's gone. Now, one checker short for tomorrow. Uh, I'm available. I don't need baggers, I need checkers. Oh, come on, Ricky. I'm ready to move up now. Besides, I've got checking in my blood. I don't know. Hey, you said you were shorthanded? Use these hands. Thunder. And lightning. <laughs> OK, but only because I'm desperate. Desperate works for me. <laughs> How about that, Mama? A new challenge and time and a half. Do you know who shops here on Thanksgiving Day? Men. Angry men. <laughs> men whose wives have dragged them away from football games and sent them down here. They hate being here. And they want to get out as quick as they can, but they can't. Because they don't know where a doggone thing is. <laughs> and they're going to take that anger out on you. Because you're the last thing that's standing between them and their lazy boy. That's OK. I can handle that crowd. You see, I'm a man. I'm a checker. I'm a checker man. I've been working hard. Jobs every day, giving time to my children, showing them the way. With God on my side, keeping me in line. I don't worry about a thing, it's gonna be fine. We are so we know you got it. Got my family, your family, your home, your life, you never be Love the spirit of the day. Actually, I feel like I can use another hour's sleep. <laughs> Cut those eyes open, girl. This isn't just any holiday. This is a once a year feast. We're eating in the living room, girl. Okay, Mama. Now, are you ready to throw your body and soul into the essence of the day? Yes, Mama. Make me believe it. I'm in the essence. <laughs> yes, you are. Now, first, we need some cooking woman music. I like Aretha. Cause she's a big, pretty cooking woman just like your mama. But that's me. You got to find your own cooking woman music. Now, you're ready for your peeling and your chopping and your blending and your whisking, which takes you to your frying and your steaming and your boiling and your basting. Woo! Smell that stuff and smell that pie. Mama's turkey will make you cry. Are you feeling it, baby? I'm trying, mama. Don't try. Remember the 
Listen, just let go. I'm letting go, Mama. Yes, you are. And pretty soon, those cooking smells are gonna start sliding out there. And your brother's gonna go slipping in here. Well, they can slip right back out, because they only in here to sneak a taste. But that's okay. It's when they want that second taste. You know it's good. So you just wrap them on their greedy fingers and run them on out here, because you don't need them anymore. Got it. Watch for the double taste. There you go. Now, the boys know their chores for the day. And if you want them to do anything else, you just tell them, because you're in charge. You are queen of the kitchen. And they are your subjects. Queen Denisha. I like that. I knew you would. Morning, Mom. Morning, son. Hey, checker man. Hey, cooking woman. <laughs> you showing some stuff down there today. And you make this kitchen jump, all right? Come on, let's go, Mom. Cooking woman, checker man, both my babies are working today. <laughs> There you go. Happy Thanksgiving. Huh. Check this out. I can check and bag. Hey, who? Nice catch, Lightning. Thank you, Thunder. <laughs> Boy, you've been working 45 minutes in a store that's only been open for 15. Talk to me about no sweat in four or five hours. <laughs> Mama, let's face it. Checking in a market isn't exactly brain surgery. Uh, what I meant was, uh, this job obviously has a multitude of complications. Boy, shut up. Okay. Oh, here's a Lynette. Wait a minute. Mama, she has food in a basket. Now, you promised us she'd just do the beverages this year. I know, baby. But she had a heart set on cooking something, so I told her to cook broccoli. Broccoli? Well, that's safe. Hey, y'all. Hey. I got my broccoli. Oh. Yes, yes, yes. Good old broccoli. Lots of vitamins there. <laughs> Check me out, Mr. Checker. <laughs> now, you got this broccoli thing down, haven't you? You put it in some water and boil it. That's it. Well, that's almost it. <laughs> then I add in my secret ingredient. No, 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 no. <laughs> Ain't no secret ingredient in broccoli. Oh, there's a secret ingredient in Broccoli Lynette. <laughs> Wouldn't be these marshmallows, would it? Oh, Lord. <laughs> I know I should have bought those at a different store. <laughs> All right, uh, Lynette, there you go. Have a nice day. All right, and you guys don't work too hard. <laughs> Jarvis, baby, you forgot my marshmallows. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> uh, James, stop looking at that bowl and get up in it. Oh. What do you want, Jerome? <sighs> James, you're seven now, right? I'm seven and a quarter. <laughs> ah, almost a man. <laughs> well, I think it was time you were introduced to a man's way to enjoy Thanksgiving. I'm ready for that, Jerome. <laughs> Good, sit down. Now, Thanksgiving is the one day of the year when a man can watch football from sunup to sundown, and the women accept it as a fact of life. But what about our chores? Ah, that's why the good Lord gave us halftime. <laughs> Let me show you what I've got. Ah, see? Now, see, we start off with the Chicago Bears in the Detroit Lions game, followed by the Miami Dolphins and the Dallas Cowboys. And as the afternoon phase, you've got Texas and Texas a and And just when you think there's no more football to be had, boo yell! <laughs> Peg Blue Bomber square off against the Edmonton Eskimos. Now, look, I know it's Canadian, but it's football. <laughs> okay, let's watch. Uh, James, you just broke uh, rule number one. What did I do? <laughs> you see, the senior male controls the remote. That's me, homie. <laughs> hey, look, there's a Spider-Man float. <laughs> Are we watching football or what? All right. Hey, fellas. Hey, Uncle Charles. Good, you got the game on. Yeah. <laughs> hey, rules are rules. Is that Lynette coming over? Yeah, later. She's got something green and white cooking on the stove. <laughs> I think she was getting ready for a taste test, so I shot over here. Charles, Jerome, I need you to take out the trash. Oh, in a minute after the kickoff. 
Rule number two, avoid helping in the kitchen as long as you can. That's right, it's a scientific fact. Big plays always happen when you're doing something for the cook. <laughs> like that great Montana the Clark pass that won the championship game. Man, you missed that? I was shifting racks in the oven. <laughs> Damn, that still chaps my head. Jerome, could be working in the kitchen, man. <clears throat> That'll be 1928, sir. Now, how would you like to pay for that? Uh, I was thinking about with the 20 I just gave you. Oh, right. <laughs> you forgot his coupons. Oh, yeah, right. Coupons. Let's move it. Hey, I'll take some of you over here. My mo what are you doing? I'm just trying to help you out. OK, OK, I, I appreciate that, but I I'm doing fine here. Hey, yo, this ain't my stuff. What are you doing? Huh? Man, give me that nutmeg, man. <laughs> Took me long enough to find it. I'm sorry. What happened? Nothing, nothing. OK, I'll just have to void this off your receipt. It'll only take a second. Uh, where, where's the... Hit the minus key and scan it back across. It. Where is the sale? Oh, man, I must have canceled it. No, sugar. Just hit your subtotal key. Press something, sugar, so we can get out of here. <laughs> OK, OK. Uh, I got it from here. Are you sure? Mama. Okay, I'm gone like the wind. <laughs> okay, okay. That'll come to uh, $962.28. What? Why isn't this line moving? Oh, Ricky, he just got caught up in a little snag. Yeah, a $900 snag. <laughs> it's okay, it's okay. I, I think I know the problem. Yeah, me too. And I'm looking at him. Start bagging. Well, what are you, serious? Jarvis, Ricky's the manager. I'm sorry, Jarvis, I got a store to run. But I was doing it, man. Yeah? Well, maybe next time you'll do it right. Now get the bag. But Ricky... Jarvis. Look, the only words I want to hear from you are paper or plastic. Now hit it. Hey, look, man, I didn't come here to bag, OK? I came here to check. I'm sorry, Mama. I I'm out of here. I wish I was. <laughs> Deceive me or does it smell like food up in here? <laughs> Good food. Silence, peasant. The queen has no time for idle chit chat. The essence of Thanksgiving is moving through me. I am in harmony with the day. I am the parts. <laughs> and I am the whole. <laughs> Denisha, I'm impressed. I mean, I was sure I was gonna have to dip into my savings and spring for Thanksgiving pizza. <sighs> I don't think you can get a pizza for a dollar and a half. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna get back to this game. See ya. Taste of things, I'm gonna be eating a lot. <laughs> Hi, guys, how's everything? Mm hmm. Ooh, I see you set the tape. Looks like you did your chores. Mm hmm. <laughs> <laughs> mm hmm. Somebody's throwing down up in here. And that somebody up in here is me. Oh, look at my girl. I am so proud of you. Mm. There's still a few things left to finish, but everything's right on schedule. Oh, well, thank you, baby. You've done a great job. Now, you can go on in the living room and relax. Relax? I'm not finished yet. Oh, sure you are. You've been cooking all day. Now, go on, girl. Go, 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 go. Mama, I've done... Now, scoot. I got gravy to make. Now, see, I think I need a chopped onion. Thank you, sugar. Okay, so I don't pay the bill.
meals around here. But that was my kitchen today. She's cooking my gravy, turning off my music. Ooh. Now, wait a minute. What are you doing over here? Is that dinner finished? <laughs> it is for me. I've been kicked out by the queen of cuisine. Who's that? Mama. Mama's home? <laughs> you saw me. I was burning in there. She just came in and took over. I tell you one thing. I'm out of the essence of the day. Kitchen dispute. Best to stay out of that. I'll be right back. Tell me what happens. It never fails. I better go change. I'll see you later. Bye, Uncle Charles. Bye. Kitchen's smelling mighty good. Well, you have to tip your hat to Denisha for that. <laughs> yeah, I know. I snuck a taste when she wasn't looking. I tried for two, but she spooned me. <laughs> you need any help here? You want to help? You got a fever. <laughs> the game's still on. What's on your mind? How best to say this? Okay. It's Super Bowl Sunday. And you're the second string quarterback on the team that's made it all the way. Now, just before game time, the first string quarterback doubles over in pain. You started. My big chance. That's right. And you're giving it all you've got. Because I'm good. Oh, you're awesome. You're passing like Marino, scrambling like Moore. Fourth quarter, clock's running down, and you're a field goal behind. Now, you just drove your team all the way to the one-yard line. Now, you know what happens then? I call for a snap, fake to the fullback, and dive in for the winning score. <laughs> that's wrong. <laughs> Play action pass? Good call, but no. Coach pulls you from the game. Why? Well, the first string quarterback is feeling better. You're out. He's in. That stinks. I was one yard away from pay dirt. I was hot. Stay with that feeling, Mama, because I'm bringing it home. <laughs> now, let's say the Super Bowl is Thanksgiving dinner, and you just came in. So that would make the second string quarterback... Denisha. Little food for thought. Jerome? Yeah. Thank you, baby. Hey, you know, I'm just here to help out. Let me get one of these biscuits. <laughs> Boys look good, don't they? <laughs> Ooh, someone took the long way home. Well, I needed to walk around a little bit, but. I got cold, so... Well, I'm surprised as hot as you were when you left the store today. Mama, do we have to talk about this? No, not if you don't want to. Good. You know, I can't believe what Ricky did. <laughs> Neither can I. And did you check out that attitude? Hey, maybe next time you'll get it right. I would have handled the whole situation differently. See, you know what's up. I'd have fired your narrow behind right on the spot. But why? I mean, for making one little mistake? No, for mouthing off to Ricky and walking off the job. But, Mama, he embarrassed me in front of all those people. He could have given me a break. He doesn't have to. He's your boss. He tells you what to do. But, Mama... Are you having a problem with this concept? Well, let's take it to a venue that you can understand. Now, at home, I'm your boss. And when I tell you something that you don't like, you don't buck up in my face, do you? No, ma'am. And you understand that I could and would terminate your tail on the spot, now, don't you? Yes, ma'am. Now, see, that's the difference between bosses and mamas. Bosses don't love you when you mess up. You know, I really thought I could handle it. And I'm sure you could, with a little practice. After all, it's not brain surgery. <laughs> I knew that was gonna follow me home. You know, I talked to Ricky. And he's willing to forgive and forget, as long as you apologize. Great. I better call him, huh? Before you do that, first help me mend the fence of my own. Work with me now, son. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? I said work with me. Come on. I don't know. <laughs> Denisha! What's wrong, Mama? Denisha, my 
mama threw her back out when she was trying to lift that turkey and put it on the counter. I'm not going to be able to finish dinner. So you want me to do it? Would you? Sure, mama. Thank you, baby. <laughs> Touchdown. <laughs> Yeah. He's a natural, isn't he? Look at this little balled up fist. <laughs> Come on, boys, it's time to eat. Oh, right. Yeah. It's not over yet. We still got that big Edmonton Winnipeg game. <laughs> Let's say Grace. This year we're gonna start with James. Yeah. Okay. Dear Lord, bless his food in the hands I prepared it. Bless this house and the family within it. Bless this day and let it remind us to be thankful for all we have. And to be mindful of those who have not. And Lord, thank you for another year together, helping each other, supporting each other, and loving each other. And thank you, Lord, for Mama's miraculous recovery. <laughs> Amen. Amen. All right. Let's see. Yes, let's uh, do this. Mm. <laughs> Broccoli, anybody? What was your favorite thing tonight, Mama? Well, if I had to pick, I'd have to say the sweet potato pie. And it was okay that I changed your recipe by putting a little extra cinnamon? Oh, that first bite took me by surprise. But the rest went down real smooth. What was your favorite thing? No question, watching my brothers clean up this mess I made in here. <laughs> you know, I'm really proud of you. You did a great job. Are you sure you're not just saying that? Oh, you need proof. Come on. The one sure sign of a successful Thanksgiving dinner 